let's talk about our first memories of each other. My first memory of Rosie was my ex-girlfriend. This is her hair. This is her eyes. <laughs> <laughs> um, she looks like um, a Lego person. Right. It's right. a really good caricature. Thank actually. you, Rosie. Now she showed me this picture of you. Now this picture of you, let me just put her little arm down here. I don't know what this is. This is an elbow of some sort. Right? Was it meant to be a breast and then it all went wrong? Yeah, it might be. The first picture I saw of you looked like this. <laughs> Be ex-girlfriend showed me a picture of Rosie um, to say that that was her ex-girlfriend and I fell in love with a picture <laughs> with a picture okay so that's what happened I gate crashed one of Rosie's parties that I found out about you see I wasn't actually invited to it so I invited myself as one does I went with Emma Carlisle as a ghost here we are so Emma and I went to Rosie's Halloween bash um, as ghosts so that no one could recognise us, not that anybody would because no one knew us, we had no friends, and Rosie went as the Queen of Hearts. And it was cold that day. <laughs> Coincidentally, Rosie's party was the first memory that Rosie had of me, even though it was two years after my first memory of Rosie. Insulting. So, there you go. Oh, Rosie, should I destroy your boyfriend that you had at the time? Yeah. Okay. Great. That's done. Plank of wood. Excellent. So that was your boyfriend. I'll give him some eyes, so what that mean. And that now looks like Beaker from the Muppets. I was sat on uh, my computer because I used to go on like Amazon. Why are you a sperm? Why are you not neat spending I'm backwards sat, like I'm black swan? I'm, I'm sitting on a chair. Okay, I see that. I had a message um, from Rose Dix and I was like, oh, I know of Rose. She's, um, we had a mutual friend, didn't we? Rose sent this message and it was like, hey. <laughs> uh, and it basically said like you've never met me. I did not yeah. say that. Yeah, you did. Um, and you were like, I want to come to your party, but I'm not invited because obviously I didn't really know this girl. <laughs> uh, and she was like, but I'm coming anyway. So I was like, oh, okay. Um, well, nothing I can really do about that. And I didn't reply because I was like, well. She said, hi, I'm going to your party. So I was like, oh, okay, so Rose is going to my party. Rose came up to me. Yeah. Hey, why am I so big? It's That's cruel. Ghost. That's cruel. I wasn't that big. Yes. Rosie, I'm four times your size. So I had a friend um, called Square. So I'm just going to draw a square. <laughs> and um, basically, Rose was like, I didn't know any of this. But Rose was like, oh, Square, like, introduce me to Rosie. So Square brought her Rose over and was like, Rose, this is Rose Dix. And I was like, oh, hi. Um, and Rose was like, hi! And I was like, wait, you're Rose, you're Rose Dix, you like messaged me. And, I like, wasn't wearing the at, costume at you, the time. You, you go to Hereford College of Arts, and, and she was like, yeah, yeah. And I gave her, yeah, she wasn't wearing, she took the costume off, so to reveal. To reveal what? Creepy yeah. lollipop boy. And I was like, hey Rose, and I gave her a little kiss on her cheek, just here. <sighs> so, so that was the first time we ever met. So, I see Rosie Sporton walking down the street. I then went back to my ex-girlfriend's house to drop her off, and I actually thought about making a 360 degree turn to go and see if it was Rosie. Then I felt too guilty because I thought I shouldn't be interested in any other person other than my current girlfriend, and I drove home feeling bad. This is my house. This is my house where I grew up. So the second time I saw Rosie, I was in the car again with Emma Carlisle, my friend Tom, and my ex-girlfriend. This is a slightly bigger car. There were four of us in there. There we go. That's four of us. That's how everyone looks in cars when there's four of you in there. And I drove past Rosie's house. Now, Rosie's house looked like this, and Rosie's room was in the very front. Now. We were making some progress down the street and Emma and I looked up and Rosie happened to have just come out the shower. Now Rosie was standing there 
hair, totally naked. Rosie, I can't draw. Rosie, what the hell? You can draw Rosie. Rosie, you're standing there with a towel, kind of going around her back, drying off after the shower. And I was like, oh my god, I just saw Rosie sport naked, even though my current girlfriend's in the car. My feelings! <laughs> Rosie worked at a supermarket called Lidl's. Yay! Yay! I was like, ah, oh, she kind of like, oh, that's what you did? You raised your eyebrows and like kind of like gave me this sexy, really sexy, seductive look. I had a boyfriend, um, and Rose, Rose and her girlfriend is black, and I, had, I still had a boyfriend, and we lived together in this block of flats, because it was like one of my first flats I lived in, and he came and moved in with me. We were all sat there, me and my boyfriend, James, next door, some friends, my boyfriend's friends, and my friend. An ant colony! And we were watching YouTube, and I said, hey, check out this girl. She did a Kesha um, parody of one of her songs, which was really funny. I said, yeah, I know that girl. Um, she's a lesbian. Uh, I said, I really fancy her. And I said to my boyfriend, I said, hey, if uh, me and you ever split up, um, that's meant to be a broken heart. Just put a big jagged line between you two. Oh, clever. Yeah, if we ever split up, um, I said, I'm going to get off her because she really fancies me and I really fancy her. A while later, unfortunately, me and my boyfriend, um, we did split up. Um, that's me. And I was very sad at the time. Yeah. So this is the cinema screen. These are all the little people in front of us. I like how that's progressed into nothing. Um, here in the back of our heads. And this was the time where Rosie pretended that she was scared of paranormal activity. Pretended? I was fucking shit on Rosie, myself. Rosie, no you weren't. But I did need to Paranormal activity. <laughs> and she acted like she was scared just to hold my hand. I was scared, but I didn't need to hold your hand. Well, why didn't you just place a boob in my hand? I would have been way happier. Oh. We were standing in a car park and I'm gonna do it from the side, okay? <laughs> Boobs. Um, and Rosie stood there and said, you're gonna kiss me now, aren't you? And I said, uh, yeah. And we had a kiss and then she went and put her knee <laughs> in between my legs. <laughs> Draw the car. <laughs> and that was a bit sexy. And then a load of guys in the background were like, oh, two girls kissing. And I was like, I'm just gonna ignore that and enjoy this moment. Where's the other side of my face? It's okay. Here it is. <laughs> yeah, when those two guys are oh, so good. Like, great, that's our first fucking kiss. Yeah, but it was great. I was so happy with that first kiss that I got in the car afterwards and fist pumped. Rose stole um, her perfume off her mum, who was angry and was like, oh, have you stolen my perfume? And Rose was like, no. And she kept saying, no, I haven't stolen it. And she had. And what she, the fuck is that? That's your mum looking angry. Huh. And she was like, Ugh. but anyway, she stole it. It was Kylie Minogue's darling. Um, and basically, everyone, during the first period when we were like dating, all our first dates and like first few months we were going out, Rose always smelled amazingly of this. She used to pour it on. And now whenever I smell that smell, it really reminds me of the first time we did it, which was on our second date. And we sort of like rolled onto this rug and um, that is my ass. On our third date, Rosie and I made a video I can't really remember what this video was about, Rosie. It was our first ever YouTube video, and I don't know why we made it. It wasn't actually a YouTube video, we didn't put it online. I have lesbian denim t-shirts if I was ever famous. Or maybe just lesbian denim t-shirts made of denim. T-shirts made of denim! It's like a... a it's... No, I wouldn't wear it with my... I would look great right on a strappy it. top, like, oh, I look great right now. <sighs> I love this, though. Right, so I made it myself. Oh. Uh -huh. Did you actually? Yeah, for a Hooters party. I've seen the pictures on Facebook, I was perving on them. Well, I'm not surprised. Yeah, okay. <laughs> perv on me in real life. <laughs> I am a massive perv. Yeah. 
She was taking pictures of me earlier when I didn't know she was taking pictures. She was close, I swear! We're starting a new channel called Daily Gaze. <sighs> we, we just need to have our own style. It'll probably be very gay. I wanted to make a YouTube video for Make Me Heart because I was absolutely obsessed with You Deserve a Drink. In that video there are some outtakes that I don't think anybody saw. Um, and I told Rose to stop texting other women. Oh my god, that's because, on Facebook. Is it? Yeah. Um, because I got quite drunk and I was like, stop texting other women. Because when Rose and I started dating, Rose was trying to be very cool and we were trying to play it chill with each other even though we really liked each other. So like Rose was texting this girl and I was like, I don't know, talking to other people as well. And I'm like, stop texting other women. And Rose is like, oh, okay. <laughs> Getting serious. So I think I started to tell Rose that, like, I was quite liking her. Stop texting other women. Ooh. <laughs> 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 it wasn't a joke. It wasn't a joke, was it? It's a joke. <laughs> Rose! Stop it. Ten months later. Rose, you spelt mum's wrong. Yeah. <laughs> Ten months later, <laughs> I learned English. Ten months later. <laughs> and uh, Rosie and I decided to make it official. Now we well, decided. I decided. Oh, you decided, did you? Because I went round to your mum's house and you were texting this girl and I was like, stop it. And you were like, well, I can do what I want because we're not together. And that's when I decided. And this is the date we first made it completely official that we were together. We've, well, we've made it official before and then we'd sort of backed out of that. But this, this was is the our other anniversary. anniversary. That's the date we first went on a date. Because we started dating, we didn't stop, did we? We never yeah. stopped dating. No, we never stopped dating. Rose. <laughs> why? <laughs> and then I said, Rosie, will, why can't I write? Will you marry me? And you said, blah, 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 I said, blah, is this blah, real life? Blah, 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 yeah. Yes. So Rose and I are definitely planning to have children in the future. Hopefully we want two. Um. <laughs> Can you not? The end. But also... <gasps> the beginning! The beginning! The beginning! The beginning. Rose, is it two ends in the beginning? Babe, it's hangman. What have I said? Hangman. Hey, I'm... Because you're hanging him? I don't know. E. No. 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 H. Yes. N. Yes. <laughs> Baby spells it Hanman. <laughs> Which is the appropriate and correct spelling of the game Hanman. Where's he's hanging? The point is to make him hang.